joining us now. First of many appearances on SportsCenter, Tim Hardaway, our point guard of our new NBA staff. And let's begin with the crazy scene that took place with the Lakers and the Kings beginning of the game. Uh, you're familiar with these kind of things, obviously. <laughs> Former Heat player, Heat, Knicks, that rivalry. Was this premeditated by the Kings, considering what has gone on with them in the past with the Lakers? No, I don't think it was premeditated. I think that all that stuff that escalated in the playoffs last year with the Kings, um, feeling that they should have won a series, which they didn't, and then talking about it, and then Lakers talking about it, and then Shaquille talking about the, you know, the Sacramento Queens and everything. Right. You know, that, that, you know, it didn't really escalate it, but it was just, it was just gonna be a tough physical game anyway. And then, you know, when I saw all this, I knew this. I thought somebody was gonna get hurt during the course of this game. This turned into a playoff game all over again. And look at Shaq coming in to defend his, <laughs> coming in to defend his players. You know, that's what you're supposed to do. Come in, defend your ball player, and that's what he did. But I think Phil done the right thing by keeping his players on the court and not in the, um, not, not, not coming back around there. Just keep them on the court, keep them away from that, so nobody gets suspended for the regular season because he need all his ball players for the regular season. I know you're a company man now. When is the first time those two teams meet in the regular season? It's uh, September. I mean, not September. Uh, December 25th. Right, on ABC. On ABC, and it's going to be a tough game. Ooh, I feel it. I feel it. I love it. I love it. Now let's switch gears and let's talk about the Wizards that we watched them on ESPN as well earlier Friday. How many wins this year for MJ's crew? I think they're going to win about 40, 45 games. Why um, are they going to be better? Why? Because MJ has a, a crew that he can trust now. He has Stackhouse. He has... Uh, 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 Brian Russell, Larry Hughes, yep. and uh, he can rely on Stackhouse to make shots and, and, and be there and keep it close for in the fourth quarter when he comes in the game in the fourth quarter and does his magic like he always been doing. What about not having a big guy in the middle? I know Charles Oakley at will supply some help, the veteran, but is that gonna that's gotta hurt? No. Uh that's that, that that's gonna hurt, but who 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 on the east are you going to um Only Alonzo is not there. Right. Only the Kimbe tumble. That's it in the East. And it is wide open, as you know. Exactly. Tim Hardaway, thanks for the insight. Hey, thank you. Steve?